Hey guys, welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today we have a brand new robot to showcase called the all new AI Moobot by Rita Star. Now, this is particularly a part of four series robots that you can go ahead and build from a lighter blue version like this, a purple, dark blue, and a red version as well. Now, it retails about $39.99, which is actually not that bad for a robot of its size, consisting of over 350 pieces, as well as the ability to control it via app and a remote control. Now, in this episode here, we'll be unboxing it, trying it out, and seeing exactly what it's all about. So, if you guys wanted your very own, be sure to check out Rita Star's link down below in the description. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see what it's all about. So let's go ahead and open this up. So this is everything that it comes with. So you get a total of five different bags to go ahead and build your robot, which isn't too complicated. So it's step-by-step -step directions on how to go ahead and build it. Uh, this here's our remote. And then this here's our like main frame for the robot, controlling it in terms of uh, motors. And then we have some stickers, our instruction guide. Now uh, the instruction guide is quietly detailed, uh, showcasing step-by-step -step how to go ahead and build it. Total of looks like mm, 44 pages, which isn't too bad. And we have ourselves an operating instruction manual explaining how to go ahead and operate our robot, which we'll be seeing in just a little bit. So with that being said, let's go ahead and build this bad boy. Right, so we're finally done and it was actually not that complicated. Uh, some parts were a little bit tricky, but overall it wasn't too difficult. Now the overall outcome is actually a pretty cool looking robot. Uh, you do have a lot of different variations in parts. So you have these two different arms that you can go ahead and rotate manually, meaning it's not remote control, as well as the head, which you can go ahead and rotate just like this. Uh, and that's about it. Now it has some kind of like jet packs on the back here that you can go ahead and like move about more or less that much. Other than that, pretty straightforward. Now you do have a remote uh, and then uh, the remote control does take two AAA batteries, so just keep that in mind. Uh, and then you have an on off switch here, so just go ahead and switch that up and there'll be a blue blinking light. And then of course you have a switch over here as well. Just go ahead and do that right there. And right away, it'll go ahead and connect to it. Now in terms of controls, pretty straightforward. You have up arrow, down arrow, left arrow, right arrow. If you hit the right arrow, it'll go ahead and rotate right. Hit the left arrow, rotate left. So if you go ahead and hit uh, down, it'll go forward just like this. And then if you hit up, it'll go back just like this. And then you can go ahead and press both of them at the same time and kind of do one of these little dance maneuvers just like that. And then you have these two buttons on the top here, like a right trigger and a left trigger. So if I go ahead and hold um, the right one here, you'll notice that's a lot faster now. If I let it go, it's a lot slower. And even with the uh, movement in terms of like forward and back. So back, see how fast that looks? And then if you do a slow normal mode, there you go. Other than that, there's also a left trigger as well, which I, I believe is a demo mode. So if I press it once, it'll automatically start moving on its own. Kind of doing like a little dance. So yeah, that's about it. So it kind of gives you an idea of what exactly it's about. Uh, it looks like he's holding a gift or a piece of cake on this hand here and then he has a heart here. I'm not exactly sure what that means, but yes, it does come with some props, so just keep that in mind. Other than that, it's actually a lot of fun to build. Uh, so yeah, you can go ahead and battle them out, you can build your own creations, you can customize it, you can do a variety of different things, and it's really interchangeable. All right, so in addition to that, you do have an app control, uh, so you can go ahead and click on 3.0 series, and these go ahead and find the robot kit, so this here's the AI Moobit, uh, and then you have, of course, remote control, so you can go ahead and control it up and down, left and right, and you have the rocket mode, you have a gyroscope mode, allowing you to go ahead and use a tilt feature on your remote, which is kind of cool, uh, and then you have a path mode, so you can go ahead and create a path and make it follow that path, and then, of course, the voice command mode, giving it different functions, such as go straight, turn left, stuff of that nature, and then you also have program mode, which kind of neat so you have these pre-built programs that you can use like a turn test uh, you can go and create your very own now other than that it's actually pretty straightforward stuff and then lastly you have your instruction manual allowing you to go ahead and learn how to go ahead and construct this or use the app in terms of this functionality so you can see that it does have a good amount of variations or functionality which is pretty cool for something of its nature 
And yeah, there you guys have it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you had any questions at all about this particular robot, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye. <laughs>